briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 2013, the Supreme Court of the United States heard the case Fisher v. Univ of Texas at Austin, which focused on the role of race in university admissions. The petitioner, a Caucasian woman, sued the University of Texas at Austin after her application was rejected, claiming that the school's consideration of race violated the Equal Protection Clause. The court concluded that the lower court had not applied the correct standard of strict scrutiny, vacated the decision, and remanded the case for further proceedings. Subsequently, the university revised its admissions process, adopting a holistic metric called the Personal Achievement Index, PAI, to measure a candidate's potential contribution to the university without assigning a numerical value to race. The Supreme Court held that universities can only consider race in admissions if they meet strict scrutiny, narrowly tailoring their policies to achieve educational diversity benefits. This entails not only attaining a diverse student body, but also ensuring racial classifications further compelling governmental interests. Using race or ethnicity as the sole basis for defining diversity is unconstitutional. The Court of Appeals must now determine whether the university provided sufficient evidence to prove that its revised admissions program meets these criteria. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lsc.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.